Nick for Candida Hub and in this video we'll be talking about lemongrass essential oil and using it as a yeast infection treatment. So what does the research say about lemongrass essential oils effectiveness as a Candida treatment? A 2008 study in the Brazilian Journal of Infectious Diseases tried to answer just that question. The study used several different strains of Candida, among them was Candida albicans and Candida glabrata. The prescription antifungal drug Nystatin was also used in the study as well. The researchers found that lemongrass essential oil was about two times as effective as Nystatin for stopping uh, Candida. So, yes, lemongrass essential oil does make a very powerful yeast infection treatment. What you may not know is that Candida can create something called biofilm. Biofilm is a slimy substance that Candida surrounds itself with to protect itself, and this can greatly increase its ability to resist prescription antifungal drugs. A 2001 study published in the Journal of Bacteriology showed biofilm's ability to increase Candida's resistance to four different antifungal drugs. The drugs were amphotericin B, nystatin, gluconazole, and chlorhexidine. The study analyzed the yeast for up to 72 hours, and as time went on, the biofilm grew and developed, and the resistance of candida to the various antifungal drugs also increased. And after about 72 hours, candida developed a radical resistance to all four prescription antifungal drugs. This may be a reason why you have had a hard time dealing and treating a yeast infection using prescription drugs. Fortunately, lemongrass essential oil can stop candida biofilm and kill it very effectively, even if biofilm is present. A 2012 study published in the Journal of Ethnopharmacology showed that lemongrass essential oil could effectively kill candida encased in biofilm. The study also found that mixing lemongrass essential oil with clove essential oil inhibited biofilm development the best. And when biofilm was present, clove essential oil was needed at twice the level to effectively stop candida. As the Journal of Ethnopharmacology study demonstrated, mixing antifungal essential oils is a powerful way to increase the effectiveness of your natural treatment. The renowned herbalist and botanist Dr. James Duke in his book, The Green Pharmacy, also relates that mixing antifungal herbs and oils together generally increases their overall effectiveness. There is a healing synergy, if you will, generated by mixing various essential oils. This is perhaps because each essential oil contains different phytochemicals or plant chemicals. They will attack the yeast in various ways and when you have a wide assortment of phytochemicals, you have a wide array of chemicals attacking yeast in different ways so you get a healing synergy. So how should you go about using essential oil? Well, every essential oil is different, but for lemongrass, you can use it undiluted topically on the area of concern. If you want to ingest it, you can mix one drop of lemongrass essential oil in four ounces of liquid or one teaspoon of honey. But be careful if you apply it to your skin, because if you expose that area of skin to direct sunlight, you could have some skin damage as lemongrass essential oil can cause phototoxicity. For more information about lemongrass essential oil, check the link right below to Candida Hub's page about this topic. You can find a lot of resources and other information about lemongrass essential oil right there. And make sure you uh, check out the all natural 12 hour yeast infection cure that you can use. Candida Hub talks about it. So feel free to check that out if you'd like. That's all. Thanks.